What is happening guys? Welcome back to the Lunar Dark Nuzlocke. So at the end of last episode, we had quite the rival battle, which was unexpected and I ended up killing Dart, which uh, I'm terrible. Marvin's actually holding something. So we have an Ultra Ball, nice. Um, but I did do some off-screen grinding. Well, not off-screen technically because I was actually live on Twitch uh, doing a little bit of a grinding session on the team because we definitely need it. And I got everybody up into pretty decent fighting shape. Marvin's level 35 now, Charlotte's 36. Dracula 35, Ghost 35, and Happy was already level 36, but also it was technically a shiny hunting stream because I was doing a lot of encounters, and we got ourselves a shiny weed seed, which is awesome. Uh, so now we added this thing to the team. It's level 29, we're just going to leave the EXP share on it for now, but that's our little buddy, and uh, I'm stoked about it. Let's actually take the lucky egg from Charlotte. We'll give it to Marvin just because we're going to leave you in front for now. I feel like we're at a pretty good level at this point. I kind of want to play it safe because I like the team how it is. I don't want to kill anything I love. Although, Ghost is frail as shit and he's probably going to die. But, uh, also, I did teach Charlotte X Scissor. Um, it's much better than having Bug Bomb because Bug Bomb's a special attack. And now we have a way better stab uh, bug move, which is nice. So, yeah, we are ready to continue on here. This is actually a new route, I believe, as we run over this way and just make sure. So, yeah, I think this is Route 7 as we were at Route 6 earlier. So let's check out what we can get as an encounter. There's actually a TM61 for Will-O-Wisp, which is cool. Might be a pretty nice grab there. So our first encounter on this route is going to be... Hey, it's a bar ball. So uh, steel poison type, which... What should I do for this thing? Do I shockwave it? I'm going to shockwave it. Might actually be a bad idea because we're 10 levels higher. And, oh my god, perfect. We're actually just barely able to live that. Alright, we're barely able to knock it down to freaking red HP. That payback was kind of scary. Let's go for just an Ultra Ball here. We'll probably be able to catch it first try. That was kind of scary. That's a risky maneuver on my end. Going for going for that, but okay. We are able to catch it, and Bar Ball is mine. So, some spiky balls. Get some experience there. So, it's a Steel Poison. Bar Ball sheds their worn out spikes for new, sharper ones. Every once in a while, the shed spikes are still incredibly venomous and have been used as arrowheads in the past. So, uh, all right, we're going to go ahead and give you a nickname. What should we name? You know what? You're just a little poison egg, so we're naming you Egg. <laughs> that's going to go to box one, and that's actually kind of nice. We could use that as a, as a good thing to fall back on. It's always good to have steel types, but okay. Um, before we continue, we probably have some more battles, so we should probably heal up here. I have a regular freaking potion, which we'll just use that on you, buddy. Marvin, that's probably good enough for you, friend. Alright. I don't know when the hell we're gonna get to High Point City. We're probably pretty close, though. I love bird Pokemon. Wanna see them? I sure do, because I actually have an electric type in front, and you're not gonna enjoy that too much, buddy. Bird Keeper Jeff here has got a Parafull. And, uh, Forewarn is actually a great ability to have in Nuzlocke's. Kind of lets me know if there's anything too crazy that they're going to hit us with. So that's actually really nice. Marvin, unfortunately, does not evolve. I looked that up. But um, he's still pretty cool how he is. Another Parafull. We're just going to stay in. I taught this thing Lightning Strike, which was just from a TM. Uh, it's just much more useful. Solid little electric move we got there. I do really like this thing's typing. Psychic Electric is pretty badass. We get some money and we continue. What do we have over yonder? There is a Pokeball here. It's a Max Elixir. Always nice to have some Max Elixirs. We shall take that. And we got a Hiker Dude. What's up, friend? It's a hard route to arrive at High Point City. It sure is. I've been walking around for fucking 20 fortnights out here. I'm only 10 years old. My legs are tired. Oh, jeez. He's got a Golemo, which is not something we've seen before. It has Smackdown. Uh, don't think this thing has ground. It's a Rock type, right? We're just going to Psy Shock it. Goes for a Protect classic maneuver um not really sure what golem is all about freaking bide it looks pretty much exactly like what you would expect this thing to or goal kid to evolve into so i guess that's kind of cool doesn't get a bite off as in one more side shot kills it and we get a bunch of experience because that uh that lucky egg next is a hot top have we seen hot top before the hell young hot topic let's go into uh Going to Dracula. I feel like that sounds familiar. What is Hot Top? Hello? Is this freaking thing? He's a little volcano boy. I think we have actually seen this before, right? We're just gonna go for a crunch. You know, you probably are part rock type, and that's not a good idea to go into Dracula, but we actually kill it with one crunch, so take that, 
hot top. I actually really like that thing. I would love to have that as my encounter. I guess this is supposed to be like a volcano. So you could probably find these things in the wild. Let's see what we find here. Just another bar ball. So nothing quite new here. It has gyro ball. Nice. Good to know. Uh, what do we got over this way? It's probably some cool fire types. We got ourselves a max potion. We're going to take that. Always can use an extra max potion. Freaking encounters everywhere and just another spiky egg. Get out of my way, egg boy. You and your cross-eyed ass eyes. Okay. Um, are we at the damn city yet? Can someone help me please? Hello, lady. In every kind of environment, you can find a bug type Pokemon. You know, that's pretty too true. Them, them bug types are fucking resilient. Tell you what. Young Lola here has got a Fi Ant. These things are scary as hell. Uh, so it has Signal Beam, obviously. We don't want to stay in here. Being Psychic type, uh, let's just go into Happy. We ain't playing any games. Happy's the safest option here, too. Signal Beam. These things hurt. Look at that special attack. Absolute units these Fire Ants are. I think Bubble Beam does knock this thing out in one hit, though. Yeah. Take that, bitch. It's 1600 experience. Oh my god. Monsoon grows to level 30. We're gonna be useful in no time. I believe actually that this thing does need a water stone to evolve, which is kind of a bummer. But uh, I think we can get some eventually. There's gotta be a place where we can buy freaking water stones. You're not far away from High Point City. I freaking hope not. Because, damn. We got shit to do, Mr. Hiker. Herbert here has got a hot top, level 27. Um, we'll probably just stay in here. It has Lava Plume. Which is kind of spooky. We'll just give you probably just a lightning strike. You're not ground type. So we good with that. I'm pretty bad at remembering types in this game, obviously. But that's fine. Next is a moose stone. We do know that this thing is rock normal moose stone is. So we could just go ahead and probably let ghost kill it. But no, that's actually a bad idea. Because, you know what, let's, let's just stay in. Marvin's got this. Heckin' moose stone here. We actually do have one of these, but not sure if I'm going to end up using it. I was going to use it until I found that shiny uh, weed sea, so. I'm speechless. Get ourselves a thousand dollars. And, uh, looks like we have arrived in the new area. What's up, guy? You have arrived at High Point City, the city near the volcano Mount High Point. Cool, we'll check the trash can. Oh, we actually found something in the trash can. I was going to not check that one, but for the first time freaking ever, we get something out of the trash can, so that's cool. Anyway, here we are at High Point City. Uh, so this is the rail system that we weren't able to use, their cable car or whatever. You could, but there's a technical problem at the moment. Sorry, we work to solve it as fast as we can. Get freaking better. What's going on? High Point City resides next to an active volcano, but it's okay, as long as the ancient Pokemon that lies inside the volcano is left alone. Ooh, getting some ancient Pokemon stuff going. Okay, so let's check out what's happening in the Poke Center. We will heal up, and then we might as well take a look at... Um, What's going on with the quests and stuff? We didn't do the milk thing for that one dude. I don't know where the hell we're supposed to get milk in that last city, but that's fine. What's up, lady? You're a trainer, aren't you? I've heard that the other cities have some vending machines everywhere. I wonder where, wonder why High Point City has none because it's always so hot in here. Do you have some of the drinks from the vending machines? I would like to taste them so badly, but I don't want to pay for them. Can you give me something to drink? Sure. Do I have anything in my bag currently? You don't have anything to drink. Come back if you have something. Okay. Interesting. We'll come back with... Some options, options for that lady. My name is Hubert, Hubertus, and I really, really love bug type Pokemon. Traveled the, traveled away from Johto to Rakoto just to see all the bug types living here. A friend of mine told me that there's many bug type Pokemon who have a second type, but I couldn't find some of them. I'm still searching for the combinations bug and grass, bug and fire, bug and water. Could you prove that they exist in Rakoto? Sure. Um, so this guy will give us something in exchange if we show him some dual type bugs. So that's interesting. Not sure what that guy gives us if it's worth our time, but we might do it. High Point City started out as mining town. There's a cave not far from here where lots of precious precious jewels can be found. Precious jewels, huh? We got some freaking hot lava over there. I'd like to share my knowledge with young trainers who train fire type Pokemon and help them become the best that they can be. You don't have a fire type in your party? What a shame. Oh, she was going to give me some knowledge if I had a fire type, but we don't, so that sucks. I'm a ranger and I'm working at Mount High Point. Found there an item, but I don't need it. Here you can have it. And we got ourselves a fire gem. Nice. Raises the power of fire moves. We don't have any freaking fire types, so not going to put a whole lot of use to that, but it's good to have. Anyway, um, 
see what's popping over here. Hello, little kid. Why do all the little kids run around so much? Playing with my friends at Mount High Point, but my mom found us. Now she puts me under house arrest. <laughs> Mount High Point erupted a long time ago, but scientists said that it won't erupt in the near future. I know that it could be erupt. It could erupt. It makes me a bit scared. Yeah, it would be not the best idea. You gotta get some damn volcano insurance living in this city. Fuck around and just lose your whole ass house. Um, so we're just gonna do some exploring. I'm interested to see what's going on in the volcano, though. Legendary Pokemon and shit. I found something on my trip to Mount High Point. I don't need it. Please take it. We get TM43 for Flame Charge. People just hooking up with, hooking us up with all sorts of flying, or flying fire stuff, which uh, maybe one day we'll be able to put to use. If I didn't kill my damn fire scorpion, that would be great. But we did, so whatever. Hello. There's some temples around the Rakota region. I've heard that there are five. All of them lie in a different kind of area. An ancient temple at the top of Mount High Point. Rumors say that it has something to do with a legendary Pokemon which lives in the volcano. Interesting. Came all the way from Rustbolt City to the city. I want to see the volcano, but there are weird people who said I should leave it. Ooh. Well, we're gonna we're gonna fucking go check it out. Okay, it looks like that's way that's the way we get up to the volcano. What was what was I even supposed to do in the city? I don't remember. Hey there, I'm High Point City's famous move tutor. Exchange for red shards, huh? Um, do I have red shards? Which move should it be? So we can get all sorts of cool stuff. Dusty Dash, two red shards. I don't believe I have any red shards, so we'll come back here if we ever end up finding any, but that's kind of nice. Do I have any red shards? I don't think I do, right? Don't give it the old check. I got any red shards in here? I don't think I do. Mm, it's looking like, nope, I'm pretty red shardless. Looks like though we'll probably find some in the volcano. Seems like a place we would get some red shards. Let's make sure I'm not missing out on anything here. We can go up this way. What's popping over here? Do you like my hot top? It's cool, eh? Yeah, your hot top is uh pretty cool. <laughs> Ooh, we also have the gym over this way. I'm sorry, Amber the gym leader isn't here at the moment. She rushed to Mount High Point because she heard the strange that strange people were seen around the area. Nice, so we will be able to get a nice little gym battle in the city, assuming it's fire type, obviously, which could be kind of scary, but we should be all right. Nothing going on in this house. What is this? Why is there nobody here? Hello? Erm, um, what's up? Who are you? Oh, daddy. Don't, I thought she called me daddy. I'm like, I'm not daddy. Asked you to get his boat keys. What's that? You don't have a blast badge? Wait, nobody asked me to get the, oh wait, boat keys? Was that some, that's what I was supposed to do. I gotta get the badge before this lady's gonna give me the keys. That was our quest. Freaking guy at the, uh, at the port needs his damn keys. But we gotta get the badge first, so. It looks like next order of business is to just head up into the volcano. Uh, well, we're probably going to be able to find a fire type, which should be great. Hopefully, at least. What's up, guy? This is the way to Mount High Point. Be careful, there are many fire type Pokemon. Nice. Well, I'm excited to find myself some fire types. Hello, you look like a gym leader. Are you Amber? You there. Are you with those strange people that have been on seen on Mount High Point? Uh, nope. No, you're not. Well, that's good, then. I was told the strange people in weird-looking outfits were seen making their way up the mountain. It's my duty as a gym leader of High Point City to make sure there's no funny business going on. Well, if you see anything suspicious, let me know. I sure will. I'm sure there's going to be some crazy shit going on, but... It was, it was probably so damn hot by this lava. And our first encounter on this route is a cubburn. Yeah, <laughs> this is something we have not seen before. Uh, a little cubburn, huh? So it has fire punch. And I'm afraid to weaken this thing. I'm going to magnet bomb it. How about that? Uh, so this thing's actually pretty damn cool. I feel like... You've got to evolve into something awesome. It has Slash, which doesn't do much. Don't really want to get critted, though. But Cubburn, huh? We'll go for one more Magnet Bomb after this. And uh, we are getting ourselves a Fire type, it looks like. Which is great. Seems like just my luck, I would get the one fucking, like, random just ground type that's hanging out here. It does have Rock Smash as well. Anyway, time to throw some balls at this thing. We're going to get ourselves a Cubburn. How about that? Let's just go for an Ultra Ball. Uh, we only have 11 of these bad boys. I should probably restock on those now that I think about it. But we do catch it first try, and we got ourselves a Cubburn, um, which is an interesting name. Cub and Burn. Very cool. It is just a pure fire type. While having an adorable appearance, Cubburn's temper flares up easily. May even cause wildfire when engaging in an especially heated battle. So, uh... Nice. What should I name a Cubburn? Okay, I've decided I'm going to name this thing Smokey, because, you know, it's kind of Smokey, and he's Smokey the Bear, so... There we go. 
Only you can prevent forest fires. Nice, so that's a pretty cool encounter. I like that a lot. Anyway, continue. I was not actually even expecting to get an encounter there, but fun stuff. Over here we got ourselves a burn heal. We will definitely probably use that. What is happening? Wait, what are you doing here? Don't get in Team Solar's way. So the Team Solar people are the ones that are here. Look at that outfit. Team Solar grunts, got herself a Fi Ant, and uh, we do not like Fi Ants because Signal Beam is gonna kill me in one hit. So we just go right into Happy, who know we know that can most likely knock this thing out in one hit with a Bubble Beam, so. Freaking Flame Burst is neutral because we're Fire Water, but you don't like Bubble Beam, sir. Flame Burst, the thing is fast as shit. Why are you so fast? God, I, I guarantee one of these Fi Ants is gonna kill something. Hot damn. We are gonna probably go to level 37. Yes, we do. Looking nice. And next is a Snazap. Another little Snazap, huh? Well, let's just let Charlotte do it, actually. Interesting you don't have your, your little snake evolved. Makes me sad seeing this damn thing, though. I want it. Uh, Xers are probably not gonna knock it out. Yep, because it's freaking part poison type. But I should have crunched. I guess it doesn't really matter. Still did a bunch of damage, though. These things are frail as shit when they're just little snaz apps. But we're able to knock it out. You shouldn't be here. Well, I'm here. It's hot as shit, though, man. Anyway, we got some more encounters. What's going on here? More little more little uh, cupboards. So I guess these things are pretty common here. But that's fine. I still love him. Like a son. Anyway, uh, we should probably heal. Bust out the old... Oh, that, those, are, those are Pokeballs. Let's just use a, I think all I have is Hyper Potions, actually. Should probably buy some more regular Super Potions. But, I, th I mean, we have a bunch of money anyway. We're good. We're good. Got 12 of those things left. Anyway, we'll head this way, where we got some more Team Solar people. Don't move on. There's something happening up there that you can't understand. Oh, really? I bet you I probably can understand it, because you guys are fucking weird. But I'm going to try my best. Level 27, Hot Top. This thing's got Lava Plume. And uh, we're just going to smite you down with this here lightning strike, which actually knocks you out in one hit. We probably should switch Marvin, but this thing is just blitzy. The hell is a blitzy? Um, we let Dracula do it. We'll probably put Dracula in front after this. Seems like a safe bet. Blitzy. We have not seen this thing before. Okay, it's electric attack. It's an electric mon. Awful idea to go into. Is it electric flying though? Fuck. Should I just stay in here? We're just gonna. We're just gonna. Uh, we're just gonna crunch it. I think we're, we're gonna be okay. It's only level 27, and crunch actually just knocks it out in one hit. So that thing's actually pretty badass. I enjoy that thing. They will smash you. I sure hope they don't smash me. But you never know. Let's put Dracula in front because Marvin is level 37, and we're also gonna take off the lucky egg from you, and we're gonna give it to you. Enjoy. Fun stuff. Okay. How big is this damn volcano? It's just open pits of lava and shit. Found ourselves a hot top, so these things... It would be cool to have that. I would almost rather have a hot top than, than the fire cub thingy, but it's fine. And there's also little blitzies. Why, why are blitzies here? What, uh, what are you doing here, little electric looking fella? Who knows? Wow, you have guts, standing in the way of Team Solar. I sure do have some guts. And there's actually a Pokeball down there that I missed, which is unfortunate, but maybe we'll grab that on the way down. Who knows? All right. Slade just got a hot top. We can just fuck these things up with Crunch. Sorry about that, little buddy. Small little volcano friend, which actually lives it, and it has ancient power, which kind of hurts. But we good. How the hell did you live that Crunch? This thing's a beast. So Hyper Fang, obviously not very effective. But, wow, we actually got a lot back from Bloodthirst there. Good stuff, good stuff. Next is in Eclipo. Um, Eclipo is weak to crunch, right? Um, hello? I don't fucking remember what type this thing is. Sure is. And uh, Bloodthirst is actually super clutch. Saving us money on potions here, Dracula. Passing the savings down to me. Your guts won't be enough. Something tells me they will. We probably have ourselves an interesting boss battle up there. Step back, our commanders will succeed in their mission. I doubt it. These guys are just freaking everywhere. They came stacked up. Okay, this guy's just got a kidlet. Only level 27. We are not afraid of little baby kidlets. Does have quick attack, though, so that's something. 
launch just knocks yo ass right out though see you later you adorable little candle-headed bastard and what's next next is another eclipo we handle them eclipos so take this crunch very glad that uh i grinded up here because we're definitely playing it safe now even though the boss battle is probably gonna have some crazy shit monsoon Greta level 31 so we're actually getting pretty close to fighting fight in shape which is nice we can use our first actual um, wild encounter shiny, which is cool. More little cupboards, and uh, we're gonna head up this way. Oh, it's getting looking like it's getting pretty crazy up here. What's happening, fellas? Is the legendary up in that temple? Team losers, you are too late. We got here first. Typical team solar thinking that rules apply. Who cares if you're here first? We're here now. We have to fight you for the core stone. We will, and we will win. Yeah, right. Short stuff. <laughs> You got him. You can try, but I think you might be disappointed. Gloria. Marcus, late to the party as usual. Well, actually, seems we're both late this time. The core stone isn't here. Don't lie to me, Gloria. You may be on opposing sides, Marcus, and you don't have to believe me. But don't lie, the core stone isn't here. Someone has already taken it. Hopeless. Oh, Jesus. Man, the whole gang is here. Hayden, is that the strange people, Team Solar and Team Lunar? What could they be doing here? After the core stone, well, that's not going to happen. I'm going to talk to them. Yeah, you go ahead and do some talking. You, all of you, you all need to leave now. That's, I'm sure that's going to work. And who might you be? Are we going to have to double battle? I'm Amber, the gym leader of High Point City. You have no right to be here. This temple is sacred to the mountain. You're not here on good intentions. The gym leader. Yes, and I will burn you all down in the blink of an eye. Don't test me. You won't have a chance against us. We're Team Solar. We will rule the region with our orders. Keep dreaming, Gloria. Our chaos will be the future of the region. Hayden, you have to help me. Please deal with Team Solar people. I'll battle the Team Lunar ones interesting all right so we got to take on the team solar people which is fine we got ourselves a double battle here um these guys look pretty crazy holy shit they got a legendix and a cabalta oh fuck man this is scary okay uh oh so dracula probably doesn't want to take an electric attack from that cabalta happy doesn't want to take one from that thing either oh shit what do I do? I think we could probably take at least one attack from it. But, dude, I can't just double switch here. We don't have... really don't have much. Um, okay, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to crunch on the Cabalta. And then we'll switch Happy out into Marvin, who I think has a good chance of living some stuff here, hopefully. That freaking looks like a Ho-Oh. Okay, so Iron Tail. So we get a crunch off on the Cabalta, uh, which doesn't quite knock it out. But we got some solid damage there. Cabalta's is going to go for a Poison Fang. Okay, perfect. That was actually a critical hit. We eaten that up. And a Flame Burst. So thank you so much for not going for an electric attack on Dracula. That's perfect. All right. So now we can just go ahead and finish that thing with a Crunch. And then Marvin, um, we're going to play it. Well, thing's only level 29. You know what? We're just going to probably just Lightning Strike this thing. We should be... No, you know what? Okay. I don't want to lose anything. And I always manage to do that. So you know what? We're just going to Hyper Potion. We're playing it fucking safe here, boys. Going for a Hyper Potion on Marvin, which probably isn't necessary. I'm just worried about if they both attack me or something. Okay, it's so a Vacuum Wave, huh? One more Crunch is going to take out the Cabalta. So RIP that dude snack. Now let's just dust in this here Legend X. Do a little 36 there. Looking nice. And uh, a D-Rash is next. Okay, level 32. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, let's acrobatics on the D-Rash. And then let's lightning strike the damn Legendix. Because we need to kill this fucking Phoenix thing. Just keeps going for vacuum waves, which is fine. Acrobatics, I don't know what the hell this D-Rash wants to do. But it does over half, which is good. And then flame wheel. Why you guys got to focus on Dracula, man? What did he do to you? Ooh, we actually are able to knock that thing out in one hit. Marvin, you OP. Love to see it. Greta level 37. And, uh, an Explanade. Oh, Jesus. That is, okay. We have not seen one of those things yet either. We do have to heal again. We're going to go for a Hyper Potion on young Dracula. And, um, Marvin, let's, uh, Lightning Strike the Explanade. I don't know what the hell this thing even is. Okay, so we go for the Super Potion, get back to full. We should be good here. Level 30. Oh, shit. It's got a Wild Charge. Oh, no. Okay, that knocks us to half. It does take some recoil damage. And Flame Wheel. No. Oh, my God. Yes, we barely live it. We live it with red. We're good. We are... <laughs> oh, shit. 
Oh man, this is a scary boss battle, dude. I, okay, I, I guess I should have expected this, but I think we're, we're, we're at least good. Okay. Um, wait, what the fuck just... Oh, okay, I used the Hyper Potion on Dracula, right? Did I use that on the wrong... No, Dracula got it. Why didn't that work the first time? Did I hit the... I think I hit B. That would have been really bad if I just fucked up. Okay, wait. No, I did <laughs> I did use two... I used two fucking Hyper Potions. It didn't let me... Hello? What is going on here? This thing's gonna kill itself and recoil, recoil eventually. I wanted to just make sure I used that Hyper Potion. Magnet Bomb leaves us in red. Bruh, this is scary. <laughs> it had no effect because I was already full. Okay, we're gonna Hyper Potion. Thank God. And then now we can just Lightning Strike on you. Okay, so Dracula back up to full. This is the spookiest battle ever, man. The Ash is gonna Flame Charge this time. That's fine. This thing a fly Fire Electric Attack? Or Fire Electric type? That's cool. This thing has Outrage. Why is everybody focusing on Dracula? Jesus Christ, that about kills me. And why does this thing have Outrage? Is this a Dragon... Is it a Dragon Ball? Marvin grows to level 38, and we are going to go ahead and make sure that we don't lose Dracula here. We're going to Hyper Potion again, and then we can just have Marvin go ahead and get a, give it the good old, uh, well, actually just Psy Shock in case. Hyper Potion. Is this the last? Is this the last of these people? What else do you got? Flame Wheel. This thing is fast as shit. But a Psy Shock is going to take care of the D-Rash, and we have done it. Level 32. Trying to learn Rain Dance. Uh, we're going to give up on Rain Dance. Ain't nobody got time for that. All right, we just defeated Solar Commander Bright in Solar Commander Gloria. What a brat. Still better than Team Lunar. <laughs> hmm, we don't have the time to waste on this, Bright. Let's go. We have better things to do than waste our time here. We'll head back to our base and figure something out. All right. So we've done it. How'd your battle go, Mrs. Gym Leader? You win this time, Gym Leader Scarlet. Let's get out of here. You'll rue the day you crossed us. Smoke screen. And they dipping out. So we come to the rescue yet again. What is happening? Thank you for your helping out, Hayden. What could they possibly want with the core stone? Glad you're okay. It's not best to get involved with people like them. Anyway, it seems they've left nothing and has been damaged. If you want to battle with me, that's where I'll be. Looking for something forward to seeing you. All right, so fun stuff. Well, guys, we're going to end the episode here. Next time, we're going to take on the gym leader. And uh, we didn't kill anybody this time. So thank God. See you later.